Hey, what's up, YouTube fam? You hope you're having a good ass day today, but what you guys think about William Zepeda with his last performance against, uh, what's his name? The Asian dude. It was, it was a good fight. The one, the guy that beat, um, Just, Justa or Justo, the guy that beat Jojo Diaz. I think, I think it was a good fight. You know, I think William Zepeda showed that his relentless pressure, just a lot of people can't keep, keep him off of, of him, you know? I mean, you can't keep him off of you, so. It's hard to beat people like that unless you got like a really good, um, you know, defense or you got a really good power. But I like William Cepeda. I think William Cepeda against anybody at the 135, I think he's a he's a threat. Anybody in the top five, you know, I think we should get him and Frank Morin in there. Him or uh, who else can we get in there? Him, him and um, Isaac Pibble Cruz. Him and Gervonta Davis, even though maybe a little bit too early for Gervonta. Gervonta's got to start getting a better resume, though, because... It's kind of weak, but so I think anybody against Williams of Payton in the 135, I think I think he's a prime for anybody there. I think uh, Golden Boy's got to start putting up his competition, you know, instead of fighting people in the top 20, he's got to start fighting people in the top. I mean, even in the top 10, you know, he's not fighting anybody. I think the only person that was in the top 10 that he fought was Jojo Diaz, but besides that, everybody else he's fighting is not in the top 10. So I think Williams of Payton, anybody in the top five in the 135 is a good fight. I think he's really talented. I think he's really good. I think he's got potential to become one of the one of the top guys at 135 i mean having shakur stevenson in the 135 i think he's the best one there so it's gonna be kind of hard to beat shakur stevenson but even then though it's like we want to see these fights you know we want to see gervonta davis versus shakur stevenson we want to see pitbull cruz versus william cepeda we want to see frank marn versus william cepeda you know we want to see these fights which i think should happen but the 135 is like their management teams are scared of each other. I'm not going to say the boxers because the boxers themselves, no boxers are scared of any other boxer. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, I box myself and anybody, like, I'm not scared of any other boxer, you know, especially them being professionals. You're not going to be scared of another man, especially if you're in the same weight class as you. You think you're the best. But what do you guys think about William Cepeda? you think he, he can, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? you think he can compete against the guys at 135, top five? Or you think he's just a top 10, top 15, 135 pounder? But just my thoughts on this, you know, after seeing Williams and Payton's fight, I think, I think he did good. But let me know what you guys think, fam. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm going to catch you guys next time. Peace.